What's going on, you guys? Welcome back to another Tyler Tube video on Tyler Tube Production. In today's video, we are going to be uh, talking about how uh, my camera setup. Now, as you guys know, the last two days, I've or the last couple days, I've missed some uploads too. Well, technically only one because one of the uploads I did technically upload the seriously video talking about what happened, but then the next day I missed literally. So today we're doing three videos. This one, and then two more after this. So this one's going to be how uh, my recording setup. So what I look at whenever. Uh, so what I'm looking at right now is my Canon G7X because the uh, DSLR is on the table for the video we're doing right now. Uh, but in the my gear rack and how I make a video start to finish, that will not, uh, that the, this will be used. As well. So let's get started. First of all, and as you guys know, depending on the type of video I'm doing, I might need my green screen, my white screen, or my black screen. Now, depending on uh, if I'm using my... Oh, that was my foot. Depending on if I'm using my screens or not, uh, it depends on if I need my pole. So if I need my pole, it's super, super simple. You guys aren't on a real tripod. You're on a light tripod, so, you know, I can reach high places. So as you can tell, right there, there's a little hook. And then right up here is my bed. So if I wanted to do a bed video, I could film from here. Or even have somebody down here like this, holding this, and then looking at the viewfinder like I am right now. Uh, but that is a little hook right over there. Now... Here's kind of how this would look. So, I would take and place the pole on the bed. And then I would, instead of having to use my tripod, I'd place the little bar on the hook, which you cannot see at the moment. So I'd go from my bed across to the hook. So instead of having to set up two big tripods, I just have to use the one hook and the poles. Okay? Alright, but I'm not going to be using a screen in today's video. I might in the next, in the, no I won't because I'm not going to be doing those sit down videos. But if I don't need those, those will stay in the closet with everything else. Next, we have a table. I obviously need a table. So, I set up my table. I keep it as a, like in the corner here so it's like a corner set. And it sits right there. And then I have, let me get my other real tripod out of the way. You guys will permanently be there, I'm sure. Then I have a chair, okay, and then that chair goes right there, and that's where I sit. Then, my actual tripod is going to go right here. I put the big leg, or the leg that faces front, I put it in first, kind of like there. And then this, these legs stick out. And then, since this isn't centered all the way, boom, boom, boom. Okay. So there you go, there's the little tripod. Next, you have a camera. So this is my camera I use, this is my SLR. It has the transmitter for the wireless mic system, which this is the lav. I always, it's missing the uh, the little clip because I clip I tape it to the inside of my shirt. But there it is, there's the mic pack and everything. This is actually a very heavy rig, you got a 10 to 18 millimeter lens, a lens hood, because I like it and I think they're nice to have. Maybe. Then I've got the mic pat or the mic, the trans uh, receiver, which has a little, little little antenna. And then there's an ear input and stuff. There'll be a review on this coming out later. And then it just, it, it, uh, there's a hot shoe adapter on the bottom. It slides onto the hot shoe because you're obviously not gonna have a shotgun mic up there because you don't need that. And then there's just an on switch. It turns red. And then. There's two frequencies, frequency one, frequency two, if it's on frequency one. So let's say the uh, mic pack or the receiver or transmitter is on frequency one, but this is on F2, F2, there's a red light. But if I do the F2 and then F2, got a green light. So this is red and that's green, you're good to go. And the only thing is, is these do take the uh, 9 volt battery, so kind of pricey. I've got a uh, little, little uh, plate and I just snap it there. Boom. And then this is usually, uh, I check my frame, so I make sure we're good on framing. And usually this is a little too high, so sometimes I tilt it down. But see how high this is? So, I usually 
because this has a well, little sleep mode thing, I uh, take down, I take it down a notch. Boom, boom, boom. So now it's shorter, right? But then I can bring up the pull extension and then it will let me do it. Now, because this tripod here, this one that I am using for the uh, main videos, because this tripod is weird, it's a very nice one. So basically what I mean by that is there's a handle here and a handle here. This handle pivots, okay, up and down, side to side, and this handle goes like this, so this way. So this way and up and down, this one goes side to side. So there's two handles, so that's nice to hold one and hold one to do videos, but then you're gonna have to turn it on and make sure it's lined up perfectly this way. So I turn it on, make sure, because I always have my uh, rule of thirds on. That's... Pretty good right there. I think, yep, that's about perfect. And then I line it up, make it look nice. Boop, boop, boop. Boom. All right, there we go. Super simple. And then I keep my little screen facing out. Okay, so there you go. That's, that's all you got to do. So from your point of view, you'd be looking here, but you can't see. So you'd be looking about here. Because I don't really use the G7X anymore. I do for vlogging sometimes, but this is my biggie dad. Okay, so then, whoops, the leg lock is undone. These are snap locks. So then you guys are going to be my second angle for the minute. So then I would sit here, and I'm really close to the camera, so if I have to, I can zoom if I need. Um, so I have my mic on, obviously not right now because this doesn't use that, and my remote. This is the uh, shutter remote to start and stop the video without me having to press it from back there way easier then now because this light that i use is a pain and i don't really use my big lights because uh one of them's downstairs the other ones are up here but you know so then i have the remote for the light so you turn so okay let me get the light all set up here we're all over the place in today's video so there's my window i always have it open for natural light but it's uh, my light is connected to a power strip. Now, yes, this is a battery light. But the battery or something, okay, this is very dark. The battery or something will not charge. So, I have to use the plug-in portion of the, of the uh, light. So, I plug it in. I turn it on. It's at 50. And then I use this to shut it off. Then boom, on, off, on, off, on, off. And then I keep that remote on my table. And this this light's on the same tripod you're kind of you're on. And I sit this right directly inside or right above the camera. So if you're looking at it, the tripod is right in between this tripod and it goes straight up and it's right above it. So it's sitting right there. Okay. So then, from my angle, up we go. We've got a camera. So I'll move my chair out of the way. It's just a stool. I don't want nothing, nothing too nice over, over here like my nice fancy one right there with the Tony the Tiger blanket on there. So then, I'll show you what I can see directly. So that's what I'm looking at during a video. Um... Now, sometimes if my cousin's over, which lets me get, let me get this out of the way. So my cousin doesn't come over much anymore, but <clears throat> let's say if he was over, he would probably be right here, okay? Working on, working the uh, Zergog. Eh, rotate. All right, so this is kind of what he would be. Um, so you would be me and I would be Mason, so be look a little like this except he would have the screen 
um, because, you know, he needs to see that. So then I want to show you what the desk would look like. So the desk is going to be super simple looking. Okay, so as you can tell, I did get a new table from the white one. And with this tripod, I cannot tilt it or anything, so it's kind of a pain, to be honest. I'll be right, right back. So I am on the G7X now. This was the tripod you guys were on. A light tripod. So here's what my table looks like. Instead of that big bulky white one, I have this nice little nightstand kind of thing. So I keep my phone right here. Always have my phone. And then my remotes go here. Then my mic's on me. Now this little table, my little stand, I'll put you guys up here. Now depending on the video, if you guys watch my channel a lot, if it's a podcast, I use the reporter mic. And I would use this little stand for it. Um, but I don't really need that right now because I don't really want to have to carry a microphone during a video like this. But then sometimes, or most of the time, it's, this is always, always how it's been, is this is going to go right here. Okay, it's going to sit right there. Let me show you. So from my view, I'd be looking at the camera like this, my table, but then right there is another little table. What this is for is for product review items because this, this lens is so wide it sees everything. So I can't really hide any items so I have to put them up here so my remotes usually go there. Or I'm going to be getting some of those little hooks to hook them here like this light remote so I can hook it right there, you know. This is going to be the tile table so, you know, we'll see what happens. I'm grabbing the lens like it's my SLR. I'm not used to the G7X at the moment. Um, and then also, I'm going to go over, I have backlight. So this is my little lamp, my backlight. And then also up here on the bed is a lamp. And there's also another lamp here, which I don't use much. It's a clamp light. Super simple. Um, but that up there, it kind of brings down a warm light. I don't, it gets really hot way too quick. So I don't use it that much. And I'm going to put this one down here out of the way. Because it's kind of in the way. Um, and then this just sits right here. And this is what you would see if you walk into my room. This usually stays, so I'll sneak peek of the room tour. I can't be doing that. But this is kind of what it looks like fully set up. You got your little desks and everything. Yes, there's a lot on my desk. Because I use my desk a lot. And I even have a TV. Sneak peek of the room tour. Whoop. Okay. Can't be doing that. So, that is my recording setup. A camera, a light, a desk, another desk. This is more of a music stand. And then this here is more of a my review table or my video table. And my camera bag and all my stuff. And that's the next video you're going to see is about this gear. Or the gear yeah. I call it the gear yeah. The gear area. And that you'll be some, you'll see on this camera, I think. I don't know. The SLR. It might. I don't know. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time. Bye. Or later. I'm going to upload this one then and do the next one then upload.